Police in Orange have arrested one of their own and a patrolman who works for a nearby department. Probable cause affidavits say the two officers were arrested on two separate dates. Former Orange police officer Taylor Scott Salemi was charged with possession of a controlled substance. And Port Arthur police officer Sean Henry was charged with criminal trespassing. Six News anchor Ashley Gaston has been investigating. She joins us now in the studio with more. Ashley. The city of Orange says it was tough to conduct an investigation into one of their own police officers, a rookie, a soon-to-be father. According to the probable cause affidavit, Salimi admitted to stealing a handful of hydrocodone pills from a man he considered a friend on June 12th. Hydrocodone is a generic form of Vicodin. The affidavit says Salimi would frequently check on his friend who has several medical issues. That friend lives in the 2000 block of Coronado in Orange. The affidavit says the friend suspected his medication was missing. So he set up two hidden cameras in his living room and set up, quote, a bait pill bottle that contained exactly 30 hydrocodone. According to the affidavit, Salimi came to visit the friend, went inside the house alone, and then left. The friend then went inside and noticed 21 out of the 30 pills were missing. The friend reported the information to police. Officers took custody of the surveillance video and the pill bottle and began questioning Salimi. During the investigation, Salimi admitted stealing the medication and he resigned from the department. Officers arrested Salimi yesterday. The Orange Police Department also arrested a Port Arthur police officer in an unrelated incident. 46-year-old Sean Henry is charged with criminal trespassing at the end of April. He is on administrative leave without pay pending an indictment. Orange police arrived at a home in the 2600 block of Golden Oak after they received a 911 call from the homeowner. A probable cause affidavit says the homeowner heard a noise outside her bathroom window. She went outside and saw Henry standing outside the bathroom window with his hands cupped around his face peering through the window. The affidavit says Henry noticed the homeowner, ran at her, fell and hit his head, and then ran home. Officers tried to get a statement from Henry, but he would not speak to them. Henry has worked for the Port Arthur Police Department for 19 years. Port Arthur Police Sergeant Ken Corona says Henry's future with the department will depend on the outcome of the criminal trespassing investigation. Reporting live in the studio, Ashley Gaston, KFDM 6 News.